Uh, candy. I guess in the market? Is there a candy store in here or something? I don't know. Kim was... What? Oh! It's a medicine area. Like... Oh! Oh, that's actually kind of useful. Nice. Sai, is there nothing I can do? Alright, gonna ignore you. Clearly living your own life, I'm gonna leave you to it. Is there like a candy store in here or something? Yeah, there we go. Candy, candy, where's the candy? Hmm, knowing Kim Advance, they're probably somewhere around here. Oh my god, we're gonna have to fight another person. And in the middle of a store? There she is. Hurry, Vance, let's shove it all in our box before someone sees us. Hey, Kim. Have you seen Aubrey anyway? Shoot, it's that nerd kill. Come on, Vance, we gotta go. Whoa, 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 hold on there. I don't think you paid for those. Get out of the way, nerd. You don't know me. Hey, hold on. I'm not here to snitch. We just need to find Aubrey. You know where she is? Huh? Aubrey? I don't know anything about that. And if I did, I wouldn't tell you. I've had enough of this for today. Kim, let's make a deal. You tell me where Aubrey is and I won't turn you in for stealing all that candy. I thought you said you weren't a snitch. I don't need to be if you just tell me where Aubrey is. You two again? I thought I told you never to come back in here. Smiley, smiley. Uh-oh. Hand over the stolen candy. Don't make me call the cops on you kids. We've been busted. Fine, here's your stupid candy. Come on, Vance, let's get out of this dump. Heh, <laughs> serves you right. <laughs> Wait, how do we find out where Aubrey is now? <laughs> uh, come on, asshole, let's follow them. Oh, you weren't here before. We you have your hair, make a smile. I told you, curtsy, it's smiley. Smiley. <laughs> yeah, yes, ma'am. Hey, it's me, the happy, cheerful Miss Candies. Give me candy. Candy? Why would I want to? No, alright. You know, I'll take two. Bribery. Because I imagine I'm gonna bribe people with this. Smiley, smiley. Is no one in this town sane? That's all I want to figure out. Hold on a sec. I have an idea. Um, does this idea happen to be anywhere near good? Oh, he's grabbing the candy to bribe them. Wait, I thought you didn't have your wallet. Wait, I thought you didn't have your wallet. The hell, dude? Did you seriously make me pay 20 bucks for your brother's present? And you had your wallet. <sighs> Sorry, Vance. No candy today. No, not again. I don't know how much longer I can last. We're going to die. Let's just go home. We're gonna be late for dinner. Wait, Kim. I have something for you. You can't kill what the hell you want, you bully. Tell us where Aubrey is. I'll give you this whole big bag of candy. The whole bag? I mean, wait, you can't buy me off with candy. What do you what do you take us for? I don't know, Kim. We haven't had candy for an entire week. A week's a long time. A week's a long time, Kim. Come on. It's a whole bag right there in front of us. I mean, I'm not a snitch, but... Give me some of that sugar, sugarness, and I will be in anybody's lap. Come on. The whole bag right in front of us. We don't even have to pay for it. Can you at least ask if he has any taffy in there? Wow. <laughs> Stop advancing. We have to stay strong. We go to Dad's house. We'll have to, uh, okay, so your siblings. We'll be able to have all the candy we want. Okay, I'll do it for you, sis. Kim, Vance, I'm waiting. Like we accept candy from a bunch of nerds. Oh man, really? I'm sure that would work. This is a waste of time. Let's get out of here. Wait. Please, Kim, you're the only one we've got. Please take the big bag of candy. We, we even have Taffy in here. Did someone say Taffy? I see. That changes everything. <laughs> We're not a snitch for candy, but Taffy, oh, that's, yeah, 
You really want to know that badly. Sell this with the- Oh, come on! But if we win, you can give us that bag of taffy and never talk to us ever again. Wait a sec, there's no need to fight. If you just tell me where she is, I'll give you the whole bag. But- but I want to fight. Come on, put him up, you two. Time to duke it out. Ugh. What is with you guys in fighting? I guess I got no choice. Ugh, come on, Ashley, you know the drill. I'll show the sizes and everything. I'm not about to lose to nerds like you. You look nerdier than both of us combined. Alright, fine, let's just beat up Kim. Beat up Kim. Beat up Kim. Kel sad. Kel, why are you sad? Kel, really, why are you sad? Come on. Let's just beat him. Why is Kel so strong? Why is Kel so freaking strong? He's sad and he's dealing 40 damage. 40 plus damage. You gotta be kidding me. Kel's a monster. Was with these people, they're all... Also, he still has candy in his pocket. Why is he so quickly to, like, grab the candy if he's already got some? Granted, I understand you can never have enough candy, but still, it's a little weird to me. That hurts. I will beat you up. Come on. Die already. Fall to the ground. Let me beat your ass. Dang. All I wanted was some taffy. We're probably just gonna give you the bag anyways. Uh, so I can't believe you lost. We will never let Aubrey know about this. Come on, Kim. We gotta go home. It's almost time for dinner. And Mom's gonna be really mad if we're late. Shoot, let's get out of here. God damn it! Where do you think you're going? You won. Tell us where Aubrey is. Oh, yeah, that's right. Oh, I swear to God, if you don't know. Aubrey's at the church. The one near her house. Aubrey's at church. Hey, don't look at me. You're the one who wanted to know. Also, if she asks who told you, tell her it wasn't me. Say it was Michael or something. Come on, Kim, we gotta scoot. You know how mom gets when we're late. Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Let's go. Smell you later. Nerds! Okay. Um... Aubrey hangs out with some really weird people, I've noticed. They took the big- oh. Uh, oh. Oh well, at least we- they, they stole the candy, I'm surprised. At least we know where Aubrey is now, or at least I think we do. I can't really imagine Aubrey at church, but I'll believe it when I see it. Family reasons, maybe? I mean, that's a lot of kids' reasoning. Oh. 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 Oh, you absolute asshole. Mm. There's like a there's like a bane in the back of my head ready to pop just seeing this. Who does this? Why would you do this? Ah. Uh, some people want to watch the world burn. Why would you purposely take two spots? Like, how? How? Oh. It's, it's infuriating. Who does that? This is... Oh. Is it this way? I assume yes. That's not a church. That's... Somebody's house. That's Kel's. Is it just this way, I guess? Oh, wait. Oh, I can save. Ah, sure, why not? Onwards. That's the wrong way. Where's where's the church? I don't have a map, do I? Nope. No, I don't. Guess of course I don't. I mean, this is this is clearly not a church. It's, 
That's Basil's... I don't know anymore. <laughs> this tree? Is this it? Hey, bunny. Bunny. Oh, hi, where are you? Red glasses, lady. Let me tell you a story. I was walking back to fix it after making purchase with my hard-earned money. And I looked down, and lo and behold, a brand new garden shears are missing. Yeah, it's true. A brand new garden shears tore a hole open in my plastic bag. Don't they usually have, like, covers for those? It's really your own fault. Do you think you could help me find them? They should be somewhere around here. I mean... Sure? I... I... What? Bonsai. That's a thing. I mean, if I find the shears, I'll bring them to you, but... Kinda got something else to do. Who are you? Yellow Bun Granny. Excuse me, sorry to impose, but you look like some trustworthy people. Do you think you can help me? I need to pick up this week's medication at the pharmacy, but I'm feeling a bit weak at the moment. You usually send my daughter, Ch uh, Charlene. But she's not here right now. Sure. Thank you, children. Just talk to the man at the pharmacy. He'll understand. Uh, am I just doing chores for people now? Like, really? I, I, I get like this is meant to be like an RPG kind of thing, but really? Found the garden shears at least. Here's your shears. There you go. Ah, uh, thank you, boys. I'll be sure to make never make that silly mistake again. It's rare to see boys willing to help a stranger these days. Please feel free to come to my house anytime. You'll always be welcome. Um. What? Why? Why? This this neighborhood's weird. Like really weird. Who just openly lets anyone into their house? Without really any, like, uh, any consolation or, like, thinking. Like, really, you don't invite someone into your house that you've just met. After this, I'm going to start preparing dinner for my children, Kim and... Ah, you're Kim and Vance's mother. Ah. Uh, that makes a lot of sense, actually. So this is their house that we've walked into. <laughs> okay, that makes a bit more sense. I mean, I don't, I'm still trying to find damn church. It's this way? What the? Fertilizer, pee Come on, um, come on. Is there a church here somewhere? Nope. I will never find the church, I swear. It's a big building. It shouldn't be that hard to find. That's disgusting. Speaking of... Give me your trash. No, no, I want it. Damn it, alright. I want to pick it up. The money. M mon e e Okay... Oh, this is the church. Well, here we are. This really is the last place I would expect her. Kind of skeptical, actually. Might be a trap. I'll open the door a little bit to take a peek. Looks normal to me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh, there she is on the right. She's just sitting there. All normal. It's weird. Yeah, to feel pretty bad about interrupting us. So we should probably wait until the sermon is over or something. I mean, fair. Aubrey's old boyk. Old boyk. Bike. Like in English. Farewell summer. Whoa. Cemetery. Okay. Well, hold on, Axel. Let's wait until this. What? what? How am I gonna wait? I... Am I done? Uh... I have to wait till the sermon's over, right? 
do I like actually have to wait? Do I have to like put my hands up off the keyboard and wait? Because I'm not doing that. That's gonna take forever. Wait, we're not interrupting church. If we just walk it and sit near the back, that's fine. All's good. We should just be able to sit at the back. <laughs> I didn't expect you to just walk. Well, there's no turning back now. Come on, we have to be really quiet. Well, we can wait in the church. Like, I don't get why we're waiting outside. If she is on the right, let's walk to the pew behind her. There she is on the right. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, I heard you. I, I'm behind her. Let me sit down. I want to sit down. Why don't you let me sit down? Aubrey, psst. Aubrey. Aubrey! What the? What the heck are you guys doing here? We have to get back Basil's photos. You're still out about that. That's none of your business. Really? None of my business? We always should be best friends, but now this is none of my business. Yeah, Kel. Exactly. We used to be best friends. You know, Mari? You know, Mari would be really sad to hear that. Really? You really want to bring Mari into this? Who cares what Mari thinks? Mari's dead. Called it. Called it. I'm a genius. I knew it. I knew it. Aubrey, seriously, what's wrong with you? I get that you have new friends now, but you can't just forget your old friends like that. My old friends? My old friends weren't there for me when I needed them. So what? So that's what this is all about. When Mari passed on, we were all dealing with our own stuff. We were kids. It was hard. You think it's all so simple? You've always been simple, Kel. So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How could you do that to Basil? You know how important his photos is to him. It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you can just steal it. Is that what Basil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Basil. And I'm not leaving until you agree to give it back. You're so persistent. When Mari died, you moved on so fast. You know why I came here every week? Even after all this time, I'm still trying to find some peace. Doesn't miss it doesn't look like that's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You and Axel think you can just barge back into my life and tell me what to do? Don't be so naive. Naive, even. You might look different and act different, Aubrey, but you're still the same person. The Aubrey you knew is long gone. And the Aubrey that was your friend, she's long gone, too. Fine. I get that you're angry. Look, if it's the apology you want, here. I'm sorry. Okay. I should have been there for you when we lost Mari. No, I won't accept this. Wait, where are you going? Guys, we're interrupting church. Could you not? It's a little rude. What's happening? Basil? Isn't that the boy who... I've seen Aubrey and her friends bully. Now she's stealing as well? Oops. Oh, good job, Kel. You think you're the good guy? Don't you, Kel? And I'm Big Bad bu Bully. Here to terrorize poor defenseless Basil. You're the one hanging out with a psychopath who carries around a knife. Now that's not... No, but, uh, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who ba barged in here. Harry said I was sorry for everything. You want me to be a bully? Then I'll be a bully. You better come at me quick or I'll come at you first. Oh. Oh. Whoops. Uh. Cal. Ah. Uh, whoops. I didn't know you were so low, buddy. Uh, I didn't know Cal was so low. Oh, God. Look at her clothing. It's completely inappropriate for church. Not snack. It's a toy. Bandages are toys. Didn't you know that? Uh, guard. Let's see if we can get some, stop some damage. God damn. 
can't believe she would bring a weapon in here. How uncivilized. Never mind, I'm just gonna have to try and just barge straight through. Come on. Why are you here? What do these delinquents think they're doing? This is a place of worship. She's the one who attacked us! And Kel's dead. Kel blacked out. Oh no. Someone needs to stop them. Where are their parents? Ah, this is bad. Yup, oh, this is real bad. This girl has threats in this neighborhood. There's no hope for sinners like her. Uh, well... Hm. Serves you right, Kel. Now, leave me alone. Yay. Oh! Uh, ever since her father left. Oh. She's so... Oh. I feel bad for her mother. Oh. 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 Shoot. I know she's been kind of messed up lately, but I still feel sorry for her. Maybe this was a bad idea. Oh, damn. Um. The Aubrey's been through some shit, evidently. Wait. I guess it's afternoon. I don't know what I meant to, uh, go to Basil? Uh, wait, Aubrey, 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 where would Aubrey's house be? I don't... There's like a new couple's house or something. Yeah, you're the couple. Oh, yeah, the pipe fixing. Oh, wow. Your place is trashed, my dude. <laughs> We're really coming in here just to watch him fix a pipe? Are you kidding? Ah, the sweet sound of silence at last. <laughs> Rats, I guess I'll have to try again tomorrow. Or you could try again now. Oh! Oh. Thanks for the money. Uh, this is the new couple? No, it isn't. God damn. I feel bad for Aubrey. Oh, that's her house, too. Did she put it in the bin? Dump something into her trash can. Let's go check it out. Yes, let's root through her trash. Because that's a normal response. Trash and Kel, you go right in hand. Believe it, it's Basil's photo album. I can't believe she would just throw it out like that. So we have Basil's photos. Talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Axel? Yes! Yes, I do! up -ha. Let's get this back to Basil before it gets dark. I'll be so happy to see it. Aubrey? No. Oh. I feel really bad for Aubrey. She's been through some stuff. I what Kel, why did you throw me out the way? Basil? That's not Basil. Oh, hello there! Who are you? Hi, wait. You're not Basil. Oh, I'm sorry, my name is Polly. I'm Basil's caretaker. Oh, hey, Kel. What is it? Oh, hi, Basil. We got your photo album back. <gasps> you did? Wow, thank you! You gave Basil back his photos. You didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? I always cook a little too much. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Free dinner. Come on, let's do it. Free dinner. Dinner Roonies. Dinner Rhina. Edible foodness. Hell yeah. Please make yourself at home. Alright, let's do this. Let's eat some food. Eat some food. 
eat some, eat some, eat some food. This is gonna taste really great. Eat some food, eat some food. Da 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 da. Eat some, eat some, eat some food and put it in our face holes. Da 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 da. Eat some food, eat some food. Yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, that's some that are still alive from when you guys came here often. Wow, you sure are dedicated. Sorry, I was in the middle of a song. Yep, that's Basil for you. Flowers and photos. It's his thing. He loves them. Oh, that reminds me. Now that we got our photo album back, we can all go through the photos together. Uh, that's a... I don't know. It's been a while since you've looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. Sure. Okay. Okay. Here it is. Okay. Read. My first photo. It's my best friend Axel trying out his new v violin. He's starting to take lessons again so he can play at recitals with his sister Mari. So exciting. Just Kel being Kel. So many party hats. Axel playing a video game on the couch. He's a little shy, but he's really good at listening. I always end up venting to him when, he, when I got upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I bothered him, but he never seems to mind. Uh, we're back from the park, but Kel is still full of energy. He challenged Hero to an arm wrestling match, but we all know who's going to win. Let's go easy on Hero. Oof. <laughs> Sorry, Kel. <laughs> Better look next time. <laughs> Kel was still feeling a little sour about losing Hero in an arm wrestling match last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. <laughs> ah, brotherly love. Me showing Axel a book I've been reading. Mari stole my camera and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I should really keep track, better track of my things. It's all of us cuddling with Axel's stuffed animals. Oh, they're my animals! Hell yeah. You have so many and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Wow, Aubrey looks really different. Mari's teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Axel and Kel holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari thought so too. Hero's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his persistence. It's raining super hard today. The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with her new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he likes the rain's taste. Just Kel being Kel again. These are actually pretty nice photos. We went to Hobbies, but the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his comics wet. Sorry, shopkeeper. It's been pretty busy with school lately. We finally made it to time together and go to the park today. Here's Kel hanging by his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I wish I was as fearless as him. How many photos are there? It's the first day of summer vacation, so we all want to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel cooling off with some refreshing orange juice. Uh, I shouldn't get too close or he might get my camera wet. Kel is known to spill his drinks. <laughs> we buried Axel in the sand. It took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. I wonder if he's going to need help getting out. I guess I'll keep him company until then. Basil sounds like such a bro. <gasps> my birthday! Axel's turning 12 today. Even though me, Axel, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same school year, Axel is younger than all of us. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Axel holding up a super uh, huge present from Mari and Hero. Wonder what it is. Can't really tell from the photo, but Mari and Hero got Axel a giant building block set. Axel seems much more interested in the box, though. He acts just like Mari's new kitten, Meow. Oh, that's Mari's kitten. Also, to be honest, big box is great. Aww. Axel won't leave the book, so Kel put a food bowl inside. Guess this box will be Axel and Meow's new home. We're going beetle catching today. Here's Kel, ready to pounce on our next victim. Oh, and Axel's there too. He looks kind of sleepy. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. Kel said he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. It's the first day of school today. Uh, me, Axel, and Kel, and Aubrey are up bright and early. Aubrey's so photogenic. 
Say goodbye, Summer. Until next year. And that's the last one. I mean, there's... There's messages. Are you done looking? Yeah, well, I looked through all of them. Oh man, it looks like a lot of these photos are still mi- Oh, that's why the photos are missing. Maybe Aubrey kept them for herself. We'll have to get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. I know I've gotten at least a foot since Hero left. Uh, I've grown at least a foot since Hero left for college. Can't wait until he comes back. This year, I'll finally be the taller brother. Hee hee. Hee hee. Taller brother. Anyway, don't sweat about the missing photos, Basil. Me and Axel will take care of things for you. Just focus on going back to your happy, carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Sorry about the wait. Dinner is, ta is taking longer than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. Hey, can I be let around the knives? I, no reason in particular, I just want to cut things. Please, I want a knife. I got some experience helping my brother cook and stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. Um, I don't think you needed to give directions. Okay. Oh, wait, no, I just opened the book again. Let's talk to Basil. Oh, hi, Axel. You okay, bud? Oh, I can save. Nice. Saving, saving, saving the stuff. Oh, I love this game. I love it so much. There's so much to do. Yay. Oh, the time flies by, too. All right. Ugh. Food. Friendship. Stolen photos. A lot of flowers. A lot of flowers. Ugh. Nice. Nice.